Hey guys, welcome to David vs. Hey Film. I am David, yo soy David, to my right is Mark. Yo soy Mark. And tonight we're going head to head with Game of Thrones Season 6, Episodes 7, seven and 8. eight. I fall on you, you fall on me, let your love run free. A big hey, hi, and hello to all of you, but to returning viewers and especially returning subscribers, what's up? <laughs> Roll it on through uh, season six. These are going fast. They're going very fast, yes. And we are coming up on two amazing episodes of nine and ten, as history shows anyway. You mm. know what I mean? It seems like those last two episodes of every season of Game of Thrones are just barn burners. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. So we'll see what these two hold because we have these two to go before we get there. But I think it's going to be still some thrills and chills and all that other good stuff because it really never disappoints, right? That's what I'm expecting. Yeah. So I think more Daenerys, more Jon Snow... Uh, more Sansa, more Arya, you know, all the gang. Yep. Uh, Tyrion, all the pieces are getting put into place, I feel like, uh, as is the case with Game of Thrones. So, yeah, we'll we'll see what's to come. But, as usual, uh, before we jump in, if you'd like to see the full unedited version of these reactions, you can find those over on our Patreon, patreon.com slash David versus Film. Check it out. There are Discord events over there where we talk about this show and everything else we watch on the channel, poll voting, and more. So, yes, please take a look if you'd like. We always appreciate you watching here on YouTube. We simply ask you consider clicking subscribe. Be sure to check the notification bell if you do. A like is always appreciated. And last but not least, if we're not friends on Instagram, let's, let's be, be friends. friends. We'll leave a link to our Instagram down below. Oh, in the comments. Don't forget the comments. That is absolutely yes. our favorite part. It's how we get to know you guys, learn about the content. So please, please do that. And thank you in advance. Yes. Ready to get going? Let's watch. All right, Saturday. boys and girls, be sure to stick around for the after party at the end of the reaction. But for now, let's grab our hymnals, turn to page 2016, and watch Game of Thrones Season 6, Episodes 7 and 8. Siete y ocho. Yes. <laughs> Jumping right in. It's one of those. Are they building a treehouse? Something. No. Oh. It's like a church. A temple. Ah, veteran actor Ian McShane. Oh, I have no idea who that is. He's been in a few things. I don't think you've really seen Boardwalk Empire. Or not Boardwalk Empire. Uh, Deadwood. American Gods. Other things. Oh. Oh, I thought he was dead. Apparently not. <gasps> Bow, wow, wow, yippee oh, yippee -ay. Shock. Didn't she leave him stranded on that cliff? And in pretty bad shape, right? Yeah. <clears throat> How many men did it take to cut you down? <clears throat> Just one. He was a woman. I love that he's honest about Brienne, though, being the one that, like, cut him down, you know? Like, he could have said anything. He didn't have to say it was a woman. He's like, a woman did it. When I found you, I thought you'd been dead for days. You had bugs all over you, and oh. bone was coming through right there. Oh, Lord. There's something greater than us, and whatever it is, it's got plans for Sandor Clegane. Mm. Why haven't they punished me? Who said they didn't? They have. There you go. So, see, that's what causes my trust issues with Game of Thrones, where I'm like, is Stannis really dead? We didn't mm. see him die, just like we didn't see the Hound die, you know? Does he ever shower? I thought cleanliness was next to godliness. Yeah, well. My God, dude, you're going to go to hell. Sometimes the true path is hard to find. And harder still to walk upon. Mm. I only pray your grandmother follows your lead. Yeah, a granny, where is she? Good luck. <laughs> the Queen of Thorns is a remarkable woman, a strong woman, and an unrepentant sinner. Oh. Here we go. You must teach her the new way, or I fear for her safety. He's going after Granny now. That's a threat. Granny Tyrell. Thinly veiled oh, threat. Oh, dude. Sure. Does it move or talk? Does it move or talk? <laughs> oh, this is madness. You stay there. What about your brother? What mercy did they show him? Loris's only hope is to confess. He'll have to renounce his name and title. Have you lost your mind? Girl, they have brainwashed you. But she's pretending though, right? Yeah, I think Marjorie's about as smart as her grandmother. Yes. You know, even smarter at she's this point. She's playing the she, part. Right? I don't think yeah. she believes anything she's saying. She's just, she's got a plan. Go home. Yeah, as you said, you know, mm. she's very good at what she does. I wish she had a cane. She could just bash the shit out of this <laughs> <Yeah>. bitch. <laughs> she does need a good walking stick. <laughs> right? She? Yeah. I feel like she does. A little pimp cane for her to carry around. Oh, Rose. We said we fight with you, King Crow. But this isn't what we agreed to. This isn't our fight. Yeah. 
Tough sell. You're right. I shouldn't be asking you. They know you're here. After they finish with me, they'll come for you. That's true. They could pass brothers. I was about to say, you look like family members, right? Weasleys, yeah. some Weasleys. He died for us. If we are not willing to do the same for him, we deserve to be the last of the free folk. Oh. oh. I'm in. No. You won't regret it, my man. <laughs> I heard you were leaving King's Landing. I love interactions between these two. Our two ancient houses face collapse because of you. Oh. I made a terrible mistake. I carry it with me every single day. Good. <laughs> I'm leaving this wretched city as fast as I can. If you're half as bright as you think you are, you'll find a way out of here too. I'll never leave my son. What'll you do then? You have no support. You're surrounded by enemies, thousands of them. Oh, you're going to kill them all by yourself? Do I have to? Yeah. If anyone could, <laughs> I mean... Because what have we learned so far? Never, ever count Cersei out. And she's been quiet this season a little bit so far. You know what I mean? After that Walk of Atonement and a quiet Cersei is a very, very... She's uh, calculating. And now Jamie. These are real places, asunder. right? I don't know if they're like real with like a little bit of like artistry touched in there with it or if they're just straight up real because they look real. You promised me a lordship and a castle and a high-born <laughs> beauty for a wife. Oh, no. A Lannister always Don't pays. say it. Don't fucking say it. <laughs> but they never say when. We have Lord Edmure! What's he gonna do? What you gonna do, Blackfish? Yield the castle. Uh, right, cut his throat. Go on, then. Cut his throat. Oh! Papa don't preach. He's in trouble deep. Uh, have Lord Edmure bathed and fed. Whoa. Edmure is a prisoner of House Frey. I don't give a rough. Oh, oh, with the metal hand, too. For real. The siege is under my command. If that's not your liking, go home. Backhand you with my good hand. <laughs> Welcome to Bear Island. Oh, I love her. She's in The Last of Us. That show that I was watching on, mm. also on HBO. Max, whatever. You were named for my Aunt Liana. Who said she was a great beauty. I'm sure you will be, too. I doubt it. I think we've had enough small talk. Why are you here? Yeah, state oh. your business. That's how you greet visitors when they come to the house. <laughs> I've come with my sister to ask for House Mormon's allegiance. You don't just want my allegiance, you want my fighting men. So why should I sacrifice one more Mormon life for someone else's war? She's a good actual actress, right? Mm -hmm. I don't know you, sir. Davos, my lady of House Seaworth. Who is this fool? <laughs> this isn't someone else's war. Go on, Sir Davos. The divided North won't stand a chance. We have to fight, and we need to do it together. Devils is very good with, with the word, right? Yep. With like speaking and convincing folks of things. How small Mont has kept faith with House Stark for a thousand years. We will not break faith today. Thank you, my lady. How many fighting men can we expect? 62. Oh, oh okay. A little on the light uh, side. We're any more than that. If they're half as ferocious as their lady, the Boltons are doomed. <laughs> Sir Davos. Where the Sidewalk Ends right. by Shel Silverstein. Where the Sidewalk Ends. I remember that, those books. Blackfish, we meet again. In the name of King Tommen, I order you to surrender. This is my home. I was born in this castle, and I'm ready to die in it. They call him Blackfish because all the little scales he has on? Or what? I can't remember why his nickname is that. I just remember that he's Catelyn's uncle. We have enough provisions for two years. Do you have two years, King Slayer? Ooh. Mm -hmm. I res I mean, I respect his, you know, courage, but come on. I have squatter's rights. If you could just hear us I've out. Heard enough. I would remind you that House Glover is pledged to House Stark. Pulling rank. And where was King Rob when the Ironborn attacked this castle? Taken up with a foreign whore. Oh. Getting himself and those who followed him killed. Tough talk, tough talk. Yeah, this guy's a tough sell. Yeah. Even Davos is like, I, I, I can't with this one. Is this Theon in the gang? Yaris family. <laughs> oh. 
Ooh. Nothing but whores and bread. Why do we have to come here? Some of us still like it. Oh. <laughs> Drink. I don't want any. I'm tired of watching you cower like a beat dog. Drink the goddamn ale. Drink the juice, Dion. Drink the juice. We're gonna sail to Marine. We're gonna make a pact with this dragon queen. Oh. And we're gonna take back the Iron Islands. Sure, what the hell? Let's yeah. go, sis. I'm gonna go fuck the tits off this one. What every brother wants to hear. How is she gonna do that? You gotta watch Cinemax to find that out. <laughs> Cinemax this, after dark. This is HBO, yeah. <laughs> We need more men. There's no time. If we went down to Castle Kerman, I know that Lord Kerman. We fight with the army we have. It's better than nothing. Yeah. <laughs> we hadn't seen the tweets in a while, had we? Remember when we were watching this a few seasons ago and uh, threads had just come out? And oh, we were yeah. like, I wonder if threads <laughs> were placed tweets. It's like somebody wrote in the comments, Are you f***ing kidding me? Never too late to stop robbing people, to stop killing people, and start helping people. That's true. Well, well, well. It's always something, right? Do you have any horses? No horses. No gold. No steel. You're welcome to stay for supper. Ay, ay, ay. The night is dark and full of terrors. Oh, God. That Melisandre talk. That means they're going to kill him at the at night. Uh -huh. What was I supposed to say? They don't believe in your seven lift from the Brotherhood. You've done enough work for one day. Come on up for some supper. I'll save you a bowl of stew. Might even have some ale in the way. It's like, okay then, now you know how to speak to me. What kind of soup? You're Westerosi. Can't afford it. Oh, she got something there. I wouldn't talk too soon, buddy. You can have a hammock in steerage. First class. <laughs> It's one of the many face gods. Oh, oh no, what the? Oh. oh, oh! I knew it. Oh Lord! Oh, girl, you're gonna get an infection. Why don't you jump in the water and start? This is worse. Ah! Oh, she got stabbed hard. Yes. How is she not bleeding from her mouth? Does she have on like a corset well, or something? No. Like a she was bleeding. Oh, that's true. A slow, painful death. They got you in the intestines, girl. Yeah. How are you still walking? No one helps you. Mm, that's how it be. Don't tell me they're gonna run into each other. Him and Arya? Yeah. No, they're in different spots, but I thought the same thing the way that they cut that scene straight to this one. Oh. <gasps> Yeah, they didn't make it. Damn. Mm -hmm. It's a straight up slaughter. Is he still alive? I don't think so. I mean, I don't want to jump to conclusions, but I'm thinking no. Ooh, here we go. The hound is back. Yeah, that's one of those where like, you think it's gonna, it's like it's getting kind of slow. Yeah. And then just suddenly, what the hell? Like true Game of Thrones style. And then it's like, and then we're just done. Crazy. It was. It was good. So put on the next one then? Yes. Okay. Fight no more, sweet child. Your wars are won. It's like both of Cersei's wigs in one scene. <laughs> <laughs> and my brother, the imp, born amongst lions, our curse from within. I will slay him, I swear. Encore, encore. I figured we were done with the with the little with the play. Renaissance fair part, yeah. I guess there's still more story to tell here. She kind of looks like Catelyn. Oh, I can see that with the dark hair. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, God, what now? Probably Arya. Hey, girl. And how do you even patch that up? I mean, like you said, she's bleeding internally, probably. Oh, she does look like Catelyn there, especially. The company's moving on to Pentos soon. Got a feeling you'd be good at this sort of work. And besides, we need a new actress. Come with us. Join the circus. Yeah. There you go. She can play Arya. Where will you go? Essos is east and Westeros is west. But what's west of Westeros? The wild, wild Westro. <laughs> west Virginia. <laughs> no one goes there. 
You just got stabbed in the intestines. I mean, a little moan going. Mm. Yeah. You could have barely moved. I would have been like, oh. I don't call bullshit on Game of Thrones a lot. I'll go down this road with them and suspend disbelief quite a bit. But this is one where I'm like, guys, y'all are really glossing over this yes. pretty quick. I mean, she got stabbed half as much as John, if you think about it. And he was out for several days. Remember? Dead. That bitch cut her across in and twisted. And then she went for a swim in Cholera River. Oh! Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, it's Lizzie Borden. Lizzie Borden. What in the... Oh, yeah. He took this... Oh, oh yeah. my oh, God. Good oh. God. Oh! Okay. <sighs> the hound is back. For real. What was that? Couscous? I haven't thought the same thing to the couscous. <laughs> That's how we shake off a good axe killing a little bit of couscous. I'm going to miss you. I can't go off on a secret mission in the company of the most famous dwarf in the city. I'm going to miss them hanging out together. I like them as a team. Ferris! The most famous dwarf in the world. Ah. We parted ways now. Yep, for the time being anyway. Mm. We'll see if they cross each other's paths again anytime soon. His Holiness the High Septon wishes to speak with you at the Great Sept of Baylor. That little sh**. <laughs> His Holiness the High Septon is welcome to see me here. This is not a request. You are asking me for something I'm refusing. Exactly, oh, girl, yes. you are. Commands you. Yeah, go ahead. Order your man to step aside or there will be violence. I choose violence. Oh, 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 oh sh**. Oh, yeah, there you go. Oh, dude. See how this works out. Oh, my God. Is he dead? Yeah, remember, he's the one that Kyber brought back from the, like, the Frankenstein. Oh, that's him. Oh, oh my oh, God. This is what the? a violent episode. I choose violence. Please tell his high holiness he's always welcome to visit. <laughs> <laughs> Anytime. Woo. Brienne and Pod. Probably my favorite duo of them all. My name is Brian of Tarth. Please inform Sir Jamie Lannister I've come to speak with him. Jamie comes out, girl, what are you doing here? Oh my God. Brian's like, oh, you know, getting by, getting by. Oh, oh, what the? No, it's a friend probably. <laughs> uh, it's Bronya. Yeah. I thought you'd be dead by now. Not yet. <laughs> Good to see you too, asshole. Mm -hmm. You think they're fucking? What? No. <laughs> what the hell are you doing here? I've come for the Blackfish. River Run was granted to the phrase by royal decree. As a reward for betraying Rob Stark and slaughtering his family. Exactly. He's like, I've missed this. Let me try to persuade the Blackfish to give up the castle. Why would he abandon his ancestral home? Because you'll allow him to lead the Tully forces safely north. Mm. You gave it to me for a purpose. I have achieved that purpose. It's yours. It will always be yours. Oh, I like their friendship. I do too. I do too so much. If you attack the castle, honor compels me to fight for Sansa's kin, to fight you. Let's hope it doesn't come to that. Is she in love with him? Or is she just fond of him? I just think they're fond of one another, but yeah. Mutual respect. Yeah. Signature, I don't know you, and I will not surrender. If Jamie Lannister wants it, he can bloody well take it the way everyone else does. Challenge accepted. Everyone's trying to protect their uh, territory. Mm. I need to get a raven north to Sansa. Tell her I failed. Oh, Brienne, it's okay. Where is she? She's in the throne room. There's to be a royal announcement. There is. Why wasn't I informed? There is to be a royal announcement. F asshole. Is she gonna remember every single one of you motherfuckers? From this day forward, trial by combat will be forbidden throughout the Seven Kingdoms. Oh, that's not good. Cersei Lannister will stand trial before Seven Septons as it was in the earliest days of the faith. It's like, well, there goes my plan. Sorry, Mother. No one is above the law. Mm-hmm. That old rumor you told me about, my little birds investigated. Is it just a rumor or something more? Much more. Ooh, as we say, the plot thickens. Why don't either of you ever drink? Have a drink with me. Franzia. Where is Daenerys? For real. Get back home, girl. Home, girl. Stark, a Martell, and a Lannister. Each of them finds a fly in his cup. The Lannister shoves the cup aside. The Martell 
plucks the fly out. The stock pulls out the fly and shouts, spit it out, <laughs> you wee shit. <laughs> it's like when I tell jokes. It's funnier in Westeros. There you go. Yeah. You want to hear my joke? Okay. Which skeleton won the beauty contest? I give up. Which one? Nobody. <laughs> You're so funny. More jokes. I once walked into a brothel. The madam <laughs> says. <laughs> Who's coming? Some semen. The masters have come for their property. Uh oh. Oh, yeah, that's not good. Well, shit. My uncle will never surrender the castle, sir. You've massacred my family. Rebelling against the crown does have consequences. Because the man who shoved his sword through his king's back. Oh! You have a child now, I've heard. A son. You're a potent man. Born of a wife. That I haven't seen since our first night together. I can arrange that, you realize. The things we do for love. Mm-hmm. Edmure Tully, son of Hoster Tully, and the rightful lord of Reveron. Don't let him in. He's my lord, my lord. I demand entry. You see, he demands it. It's a trap, you idiot. Lower the drawbridge and open the gate for Lord Eichhorn. Oh, shh. You are not lord of this castle, my lord. Yeah, like soldiers aren't supposed to reason like that, right? Like you just have to take just orders, take an right? order. It's like that's how you're trained. I mean, what is he supposed to do? Oh, it is a trap. If you're wrong. We've just surrendered our most valuable prisoner. That's true. I'm going upstairs to retreat to yep. the primary bedroom. A crap and nap and Red Bull. Command all the forces within the castle to lay down their arms. Open the gates. My lord. Your lord has given a command. Oh. That's the beauty of Game of Thrones to me. Like, I really could care less about River Run, but like, they've made this such an engaging scene that I'm really invested, you know? Yep. Find the black face. So good. Put him in the irons and hand him over to the phrase. Oh, sh. Another order for Anthony Michael Hall. Oh. Come with us. Don't die for pride when you can fight for your blood. Oh, that's a great line. Why is she helping him when... I'm confused a little bit. Yeah, well, she pledged an oath to Catelyn's family. And, oh. and so and that's her family. Oh, so that's why she was telling Jamie. hopefully mm -hmm. we don't... If, if push comes to shove, I might have to fight you, bitch. Uh. Yeah. She's like... And he said, it. hopefully it doesn't come to that. So she's leaving to not have to fight him? Mm-hmm. Well, I don't know if that's the only reason, but yeah, she's just getting out of there. It's a lost cause. Oh, I love them together, though. I, I like Brienne and Jamie. At least we got one I little I feel like they have them. some kind of, I don't know, connection. Definitely, like, right? But you think there's something more, you mean? Something. Damn. Oh. Got Daenerys, to, you got to get home, girl. They got sophisticated weapons now. No more Forces. talking from you. Your talking gave us this. <laughs> the pyramid is the only place in the city we can defend. We stay here. We wait for them to come to us. Oh, well, they're here. Oh, yeah. I think they've already come to us. Shredder from Ninja Turtles. Right. <laughs> oh, look who it well, is. Hallelujah. Girl, where have you been? Finally, she's back. Oh, oh fuck. They attacked a nearby sept and murdered the villagers. Why do you want them? Same reason. Drop that arrow, you bloody girl. <laughs> you can have one of them. The main guy. The middle one, I bet. Oh, give me a honey <laughs> Yeah, nice try, dude. Yeah, they're my size. Yeah. Que suerte. Cold winds are rising in the north. You can still help a lot more than you've harmed Clegane. It's not too late for you. I'm glad to see those guys again, though. They're a fun bunch. A little intense, but, you know, fun bunch. <laughs> Still alive. She's going to hang herself? That's what I was thinking, but why do we think that? She's probably just getting something off the top shelf. Yeah. Uh -oh. But it's a, that's the that's this show for you, right? You just always think hanging. Everyone's hanging on this one and the last one too. Oh, what, what's happening now? Oh, they're gonna kill her. It's one of the many faced 
whatever's. Oh. 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 God damn. Well, it didn't hang her. Here she is. God damn this girl. She's just everywhere. Just kick her ass. Girl. Oh, sh Oh, sh That cannot feel How good. How did you? How is she? She's magic. She can run with uh, abdominal wounds, really? Yeah. And this one's like a goddamn Terminator. Like, the way she moves and looks. Someone throw a banana peel. <gasps> oh. Oh. You heard a snap, right? How does she not break her ankles? I don't know. Oh, she's bleeding now. Yeah. Oh, Damn, girl. Oh, right in the produce aisle. God. Oh. It will all be over soon. She's like, I've been blind before, honey. Kill your girlfriend. Finally, a girl is Noah. A girl is Arya Stark of Winterfell. And I'm going home. So episodes yeah. seven and eight. Uh, these for me, I'll, I'll, I'll kick it off and say, these episodes for me are my quintessential challenging Game of Thrones. Yeah. Because, and what I mean by that is, on one hand, there are several scenes in these that I found a little boring, okay? I know it can't be nonstop action every single episode right. over, like, however many seasons there were. But these two episodes did feel a little sluggish to me. But then suddenly, there would be these massive scenes of action, right? Major, major scenes of action. And to me, that is just quintessential Game of Thrones. Yeah. You know, there's some times where it feels a little like it's dragon, and then just boom. Yeah, they were brutal and violent. Very. I also feel like there was a lot of hangings in these. Yes, right? yes. Going back to, like, what, the last episode... Uh, well, the one before this past one with Ian McShane. Yeah. Which, by the way, that was a nice little guest star. I liked that they brought him in just for that one episode. You know? That was cool. He's like a big name. Uh, obviously has done HBO shows in the past. And then, you know, well, Deadwood anyway. And then now they brought him back for uh, for just this one episode. I thought it was pretty cool. Yeah. 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 The other thing I found interesting was um, uh, Brienne's relationship with, um, what's his name? Oh, Jamie. Jamie. Yeah. What's going on with that? Yeah. I feel like it's now beyond mutual respect i feel like they kind of like have a crush on each like other sweet on each other yeah i don't know i don't know <laughs> they spent a lot of time together you know i mean when they were by themselves they remember and he gave her the sword i mean that's not and that's she tried not to nothing. give it back and mm -hmm. he wouldn't accept like, he was like no girlfriend that's yours you keep that shit <laughs> yeah i got that engraved that things remembered that's i wonder all what that's need. leading up to that's a good question. Um, I, I, I maybe you, nothing. Yeah, maybe not. But I think you nailed it with like the mutual respect. But you feel like there's something more. Yeah. You know, it does seem that way. Secretly um, love each other. What about Arya? What do you think about the whole Arya thing? That was crazy. Mm -hmm. How they just stabbed her in the abdomen and she's just running around town. A little bit of disbelief. We did have to have and a little bit of disbelief. She finally got that bitch back yeah i love how you whisper like either like we're 12 and our parents are here or they're like you know i know what you mean <laughs> i try not to cuss a lot because you, you gotta classy. you gotta beep you're, you're it up classy. all the time true that's true yeah i appreciate that from the editing perspective but, but yeah she yeah. took her eyes out and all that it's like wow oh yeah yeah that bitch had it coming though i mean i'm going on. home finally you went looking for trouble yeah. girl and you got it and i love the way they did where Arya cuts the candle you know, it's like, hey, listen, y'all trained me in darkness. That's you, true. You made me blind. This, you, you know, you reap what you sow. Trained her well, yeah. Mm -hmm. And I, and I, you know, honestly, that's another thing too. For all the scenes that we see in Game of Thrones, you know, especially death scenes, yep. inexplicably, there's some like that that we just it happened off off camera, like Stannis again. I mentioned that earlier in the reaction, but like Stannis, such a major death off camera. Now that girl's no Stannis, but. I mean, I would have liked to have seen a big showdown. Uh, no, I kind of like that because yeah. it, it, it leaves it to the imagination. To that's the viewer's true. Imagination, that's true. Because so. then we did jump right to the House of Black and White with the blood and, trail. Yes. And, and then she, yeah. her eyes her eyes are gouged out. That was, that's true. Yeah. Yeah, it was, yeah, cool. was very good. What else happened in these? That was a lot of the major stuff. And then this is where I feel like this was like, my impression on it is this was like an ode to those kind of lesser characters like Edmund Tully we haven't seen in a while blackfish you know what i mean it's like tying up some loose threads you know what i mean yeah. and, and and giving them their due uh because as the show goes on and we even mentioned it you know 
not every major character is in every episode anymore. It's so spread out now that a lot of these, I think just naturally a lot of these smaller characters are going to start to fall off. You know, yeah. there's just not time. There's just not time for them anymore. I know you were probably glad though, speaking of the non-mains, to get to see Nana Tyrell. Oh, yeah. You know, I always love any time we get to see Nana Tyrell. And then we saw Marjorie slipped her the rose. No, yeah. Like, you know, I'm, I'm, in still, I'm still in here, girlfriend. You know what I mean? But what do you think about that, by the way? We saw Cersei... And there's not going to be a trial by combat. That was Cersei's whole oh, yeah. gambit. You know, it's using the mountain in dead form to fight for her. So now she's got to show up yeah. for a trial. And just defend. And I mean, oh, and we already know it's rigged. We've they're seen gonna that. throw already, her right? the book. I don't know. We'll see. But all that is to come. Uh, so that will be in episodes 9 and 10, which if history has taught us anything, should be pretty big. I hope so. I'm expecting um, so that. So we'll go from there. But we always love hearing you guys' yes. thoughts. Specifically, we always love the filming locations. Uh, I'm curious about the scenes with Arya and Bitch Fitch, whatever her name was, that were running down the stairs. Look like you said, like Italy. Italy, yeah. Maybe. I don't Florence, know. We'll see. Let us know if you guys know that. Um, but also just your favorite parts, where you kind of were at this point in the series, because we're coming up at the end of season six. We'll be going into season seven. There's only eight. So it's... Really? It's, wow. Yeah, it's out. And those are shorter ones, too, so... It's getting down to the wire. But anyway, let us know what you guys think. Yes. Uh, we always appreciate those things Thank as usual. You. Like, subscribe, free to you, help us out. Share. So if you feel so inclined, like we certainly appreciate it. Yes, but the comments for sure. Uh, and more than anything, we just appreciate you guys taking some time to watch our videos tonight and enjoy Game of Thanks Thrones. Thanks for with watching us. with us. Yes, we hope you have a great rest of the day slash night, and we will see you in the next one. Bye, y'all. I love the chase and the hunt and I set the pace when I'm running I always take what I want and I always give it 100 Don't need a bank, no I'm funded Play the game like it's nothing I'm always thankful for something Don't take for granted, stay humble